people. So we are back for a, uh, another Terrascape Feed the Beast episode, and uh, last time we watched, we had a base area picked out. Um, some things happened here and there, and uh, honestly, just never got to recording. So, a lot has happened. So here's the base. As you can see, we've got some crazy trees out here. We've got some Thomcraft trees. Potato farm. we got whatever this stuff is. And wheat farm. Terrascape loves us. Um, <laughs> got our cowies and piggies. We got the pig spar set up in here. So we got a little infinite supply of pigs, which is awesome. And uh, carrots. Some more Thomcraft trees. Pumpkins and uh, etc. We got a wheat fall. And uh, we got some. Did I say wheat? Psh, reed farm. Here's um, And we got um, some rubber trees. Sets up. It's Ben's house over there. Bunked up nice and close to us. I grabbed one of these little wisp things. They're pretty cool looking. So, oh, liked it, grabbed it, portal gun, and, uh, yeah, so we did find a portal gun in a rail, um, that was pretty awesome. Railroad chest, and portal gun, let's see, and we got our corn, and we've got, um, and we got some chickens, and then up here is one of our newer projects, we really want to get into the bees forestry just haven't had a chance to and uh, I don't know, did I leave this portal over here? I don't know. Did we lose our villagers? Can they go through portals? Uh oh. Um. <laughs> might have lost our little guys. That's not good. We had a beekeeper villager. I was pretty stoked that I found him. Because, uh, trades bee stuff, which is really useful. Looks like... Yeah, looks like we lost him. That's a huge bummer. Huge bummer. Hmm. Interesting. I wonder if he despawned or got attacked or what happened there. So, uh, we're on the floor. Oh. Bummer. I gave him a little house to hang out in. Oh well. We still got the eight berries. So, uh. Gosh, a blaze farm hanging out. So, yeah. Let's go check out some of the stuff inside of the base. So, Media came on here, he's helped. Rowan's come on and helped, and uh, we've got some cool stuff done. So, we'll check this out. Got a little storage area over here. Zap, I love these barrels. It's a great mod. Um, oh, we got a sword with a uh, Vorpal on it. So you can chop off heads. So we got creeper heads, zombie heads, Media's head. Wither, Ben, Cobalt, uh, Kenyo. I mean, he's got his own head. Um, and yeah, so we got that stuff set up. And over here we got Soul Forge. Uh, use corrupted essences, and you can make soul shards by um, forging them in here out of diamonds. And um, corrupted ingots, you make this awesome sword with those. Which, uh, you have to make some vile dust. And, uh, basically it lets you collect these soul shards. So what you do is you kill something kind of stupid, like, let's say a pig. And so we got our little pig spawn out there, so we kill a ton of pigs. Now we can use the blazes, because we have a blaze farm, but, um, just, uh, kill them, kill them, kill them, kill them, until you get tier 5. And then in a anvil, you can, um, combine the tier 5, like we did here of something stupid like a pig or cow with something awesome like a tier 1 zombie or tier 1 slime or a creeper. Yes, creeper. And, um, make a spawner. 
So that's pretty cool. There's my portal gun. We got that. Chilling there. And then me and Krillik uh, sub this awesome lava tank right here. And it's being transmitted through this um, extruder, which also makes us a ton of upside down. Uh, we can also make it make some stone as well if we wanted. Um, so we got all this awesome what's going on. Whoa. Oh, gone. There. Gone. There. Gone. There. Okay. Sorry. And so that's powering these magmatic. Uh, oh, no. Sorry. Redstone cells. And uh, we got a smelter. Rolling machine, which we need to make the tanks. Pulverizer. A couple of powered furnaces. A couple pulverizers. And you can toss stuff up here in the hopper. It goes through the pulverizer through there and straight into a chest. Which is awesome. And then we've got a couple of uh, crucibles and uh, transposers. So, got that set up. Um, and my dog. And then right here we've got our blaze farm. Which is... Uh, on this, whoops, that's the wrong switch. Which is on a switch. Flip that bad boy. And the blades start to <laughs> hack out of here. They can't shoot at you. And uh, just go experience crazy. Mobs don't really like the side boxes, supposedly, I guess, so I was told. So that's why Meaty made this out of those. Um, so we've got the two crafted ones, and then we've also got an actual spawner here, so we can still uh, level up. Uh, so we can still level up the uh, charts using this. It should be a little faster. Okay. Uh, we're also thinking maybe doing like an auto kill on there of some sort. Um, and here we've got the zombie spawner, uh, which I'll actually be changing. Um, that's our little project for today. Our little crafting table. Uh, I mean, enchanting table is what I would say. And we got a wither spawner, so same idea. As long as this is powered on, they won't spawn. However, we'll flip the switch, and they start to spawn. So, just hack away at these guys with some looting. for the best of some skulls. So far we have six, so we're definitely doing a wither fight sometime soon, which will be awesome. Um, and we got our nether portal chilling out over here. And uh, some we'll start to kind of a weak little mine down that direction. And see, so yeah, we've got... Oh, oh no, zombies are spawning on this one. So, kind of... I want to get rid of this water because it's irritating me, but I guess we can't right now. So I'm just going to light up all of this room. And uh, I don't know if I want to do the zombie spawner yet. So uh, let me grab this port gun. Where'd it go? That was weird. Okay. <laughs> and, uh, I'm gonna move this puppy. Time being. That. Close enough. There we go. Like I said, you gotta be careful not to whack these on a torch or door, because you ruin the spawner that way. Um, time being, I'm gonna set this in the corner over here. It up and figure out what we want to do with that. So now, what we're going to do is come on upstairs and set up our first. Oops, set up our first spot. Alright, so we got that. I need some 
wire. Probably don't have enough wire. Kinda sucks since I got a level 5 zombie shark here. Right, let's see, what's, what's gonna make most sense? This will go around. This way. Oh. Come on, come back, wire. Wire. Okay. Well, I guess we're gonna head back down here. And I think I had some more wire up here in this chest. Oh, one. I remember how to make this wire. Swim all the way back over, and yeah. Then, oops, we need to build all the way back. Back, back. No, 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 no. Back. Nine, nine, nine. That was on. Nice. Nice. Right, so I'll reach there for now. Basically, oh, helps if we have all that. Right? So, we'll do that real quick. So as long as the red, oh, fell down. Um, and we drift away in the light. Okay, anyways, um, I don't even know if that's real song. But as long as this is powered on. Uh, they will not spawn, so that's what we want right now. Right over here. Right click and boom! Zombie spawn. In tier 5, uh, spawners spawn a lot faster than an actual spawner. So that's what makes it pretty awesome. So we're gonna um, cut here for a sec, and we're gonna come back after we have this bottom section set up. And uh, yeah, we'll show it in action. So yeah, we'll be right back, guys. Alright guys, we are back. As you can see, we've got this uh, wired up. So we got wired um, to control both. So we've got a dual zombie spawner going on here, it's pretty awesome. Uh, so we're going to flip it to switch it, and uh, we're going to check out what we get. So, bam! Zombie girl. We can't do anything to get us. We're using our Vorpal Sword, so you can see as we uh, are collecting zombie heads, we got nine of them. And as you can see, it, it's a ridiculous double that's the whole thing, you guys are off which is awesome. Uh, the only downside is because these guys are entities being spawned by our soul uh, cage, basically. Um, it means that we're not going to be getting uh, anything out of that experience from them. But that's the one catch. Um, you're really going to be getting experience. You can't actually charge another soul charge with them. So you are going to have to go out, use the legit spawner, uh, which is why we saw that blaze one in there, and also why um, I'm keeping this zombie spawner for right now. So, uh, yeah, that would be fun. So, yeah, anyways, we've got that done. Cool little uh, review on how this soul forge works. How awesome it is. And, uh, <laughs> bats, I just did that one for the heck of it. Um, but, uh, the creepers, I'm not sure how to make it proper room for those, but that would be cool. Um, now we got another zombie I started there. Slimes, that'll be awesome. Make your own slime room. Uh, silverfish, I don't know what the point of them really is, but why not? Uh, endermen, we're obviously gonna make an end farm with that. And cows, uh, that's just useful. So, actually, um, we could go make us a cow farm right now, so we have a cow and pig farm. So let's, uh, ah, perfect. Right amount of bars. So making a soul cage is super simple. You just make iron bars in a chest shape. So we got that. Oops. We got our cow chard. Chard? Shard? Cow chard? <laughs> anyway. And, uh, we'll drop all down here. And, uh, yeah, why not? We'll just put it right next to the piggy spot. 
I'll just right click on it, and boom! Cow spawn. And uh, these spawners kind of spawn insanely. So. I need to put a. Is it gonna. Is it gonna overcow us? Anyways, that would be the soul pages for ya. Hope you guys all enjoyed watching. If you did, uh, don't forget to subscribe. Also, uh, you know, it's Feed the Beast, so uh, if it's something you guys want to see in particular, just let me know. More than happily uh, do that. Be uh, always happy to take requests. So, yeah, the Beast is definitely something I want to indulge in. Uh, that's something pretty fun. Check out. I don't know much about it, so that would be good. Oh, we've got these furnaces here for making the food. There's a little food chest next to it right there. Got a nice. Don't really need to use coal. I don't know why we are in this one. But yeah, that's our little food cookies. Cookers. So, anyways, guys, um, like I said, you like, um, don't forget to subscribe, click like on this video, and uh, don't forget to check out the other people on the server. So we will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe. Show your love. We'll see you guys next time.